joining me now is the head of industry at Sinelik, Jovan Marjanovic. Thank you for joining us on Showcase. Thanks very much. So, first off, tell us um, about what Sinelink is and what you guys do there. Uh, yeah, we call it Sinelink Industry Days, and this is the program for professionals at the Sarajevo Film Festival. It is a one-stop shop for anybody who wants to know about the situation in this part of the world. And when I say in this part of the world, I mean over 20 countries in Southeast Europe, from uh, Turkey to Austria. Uh, and uh, you know, anybody who is uh, doing something in the film business is uh, in this region is here over 1000 professionals gather every year to look for uh, you know new projects new talents to invest to uh, scout to promote present that's pretty much it in a nutshell so what is the significance of Cinelink in this festival that we are here today and in the region itself well uh, Cinelink is sort of a catalyst for uh, certain processes in the film industry, such as uh, putting talents together with uh, financiers, or um, uh, let's say helping talent develop their uh, uh, not only their scripts and projects, but also their strategies in terms of financing or marketing projects. Uh, it is there to allow them ac better access to the international markets so that uh, these films can travel better. And uh, in the wider uh, picture of the Sarajevo Film Festival, it is a very important part that is big part of, of, of the festival strategy to close the full circle from really a, a, a young film student to an established uh, filmmaker uh, with a place for their films and with uh, you know a window out to the world in a way so it's one piece of the puzzle uh, but a very important one for the Sarajevo Film Festival for example this year in our competitive se selections we have a number of previous uh, projects that turned into films that used to be projects in, uh, in, in Cinelink and were financed or uh, developed through um, through what Cinelink does and this is great. We take great, uh, you know, pride in uh, pride in this. So, what was the biggest milestone that Cinelink has done to today? Well, I think it's uh, you know, I mean, there are many. Uh, so you can look at it from the perspective of success. I would say, yeah, there were films that won Oscars. There were films that won uh, other prestigious awards and were sold all over the world and seen by, you know, millions uh, of people across the across the globe. So. These are measurable successes. I can mention uh, Son of Soul uh, by Laszlo Nemes that won the best foreign language uh, Oscar uh, a couple of years ago yeah. uh, as one of these. But I think these are sort of, uh, you know, as I said, measurable re re results. But uh, something that's also measurable, measurable but in a different way is uh, the creation of the wider scene, the connection between uh, the increase in co-productions, the uh, the, 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 the reality in which we operate uh, today in this region, which uh, in, a, in a significant amount uh, was, was shaped by uh, the activities uh, of, of signaling. People were brought together, uh, you know, relationships were created on the basis of which later on uh, the, the, the industry continues to function. So. Um Cinelink seems like it's a very it has a very diverse platform. What is the typical participant that comes into Cinelink, and what type of workshops do you guys have? Well, we tend to have uh, something for everybody. Most of the most of the guests are, uh, you know, they, they either participate with their own projects, and these would be the filmmakers, the producers, directors, scriptwriters. Uh, they would be, uh, you know, selected by us. So these are the the. the on the basis of the quality of their previous work and, and, and uh, their current uh, projects. Um, we would uh, work with these throughout the year, actually, uh, ahead of the film festival. Uh, we bring them to Sarajevo to go through script development workshops and other project development uh, uh, you know, things that help with project development, from financing to legal aspects and so on and so forth. Uh, the other big group is the group that, that comes to participate here without the project and they're here to meet with people who present their projects, of course. Uh, they're here to take part in conferences and talks. Uh, they're here to you know, uh, sell films. Uh, 
so there are distributors, there are sales agents, there are uh, potential co-producers, funders. Uh, as I said before, over a thousand participants. So really, everybody for everybody, something for everybody in the film industry. So there's a, a very big platform for networking. Absolutely, as well. absolutely. It's all about the networking, and it's uh, very neatly organized mm -hmm. uh, and planned ahead. And we try to, uh, as as the platform for this, we try really to know what are what is relevant for whom, and to try and uh, and and make these connections or offer um, uh, offer things that can be relevant for for different players. So, for example, we screen about every year. We screen uh, ten. No, actually. 15 uh, films in post-production stage that are still not released and we screen this to s festival programmers, to sales agents, to distributors, to broadcasters, those who can really take the films at this stage and, uh, you know, uh, grow and, and, from there. and grow from there, make the next step. Well, uh, it was a pleasure having you on Showcase with us today. Absolutely, pleasure was all mine. Thank you.